This is Jack. Hey, I'm Jack. Hello. Jack manages the resaw. Today we have some local kids coming for a tour around the mill, and I'm gonna show them how to use the resaw. Well, do you guys wanna see how the resaw works here? Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> I thought it'd be a really uh, good opportunity for the students to come here and have a look. And being a smaller mill, I thought they might show the students around. It's got four heads and the heads stay still. And the track here just pushes the lumber through the heads. This is like the remanufacturing area. So he's taking a somewhat finished product and making it into a finished product. You can see that like that's not a two by four you can use. It's got one straight side, three edges. So you can still get a one by two or a half by four out of it for fence panels. It's kind of all run from this handy dandy little computer we got here. You can set all your blade heights from here. You can come up here and take a look at this wood. So these are our one by eights. This is a really beautiful piece. Before I send it through the resaw, I just look down the edges here. So I'm looking down these edges. Yeah. And if I have an edge that's kind of curved like that, I'm gonna put it through the outside of the fence. It's important that the wood is against the fence because we want a nice even bevel throughout the whole board. And you'll just be guiding it, making sure it's going on. Okay. You can press that button there. This is a start button. Yeah, Jacob. Maybe oh, laugh. yeah. <laughs> nice. And then you're gonna press this button. Turn it. Left blinks, right? So I just like pushed the wood through the, this machine and it just cut it for me. It was really cool. Yeah. I'm always checking my product as it comes out. We have a guy catching. So let's let it come down to you. Stand it up, kind of bang the sawdust out from between it. There you go. And then after it's all through, you can press that stop button. All right, last step. Let's go check our final product. Make sure it's not garbage. How's the final product, Coleman? Looks great, Jack. You did a fantastic job. I guess it really wasn't you, though. It was all the machine and them. To watch uh, Riza and Jacob actually get up onto the saw is a really good opportunity that the, the students uh, have had today. Anyway, simple machine, but you gotta know what you're putting through it. You can't put garbage through it because then garbage will come out. I hope the kids learned a lot. It's always uh, satisfying to show someone something new.